good people it's almost here back with another video welcome back welcome back welcome back mm. so welcome back to the video today um this will just be another one i thought um i don't know when these are gonna go up but i did one i don't know what i'm gonna title it but i'll link it in the whoop, whoop, somewhere up here um of i keep duping myself when i buy makeup I gravitate towards a certain color or color scheme or you know theme and uh, I keep duping myself and I'm basically buying the same shades over and over but does that curb me from buying makeup or you know from has it curbed me from buying makeup like that no none whatsoever whatsoever so here we go <laughs> I obviously am wearing a lovely pink purple look today it's been on for a while it's holding up my skin is just like weird and like I'll give you a rundown what's on my face a little bit of Hollywood flawless filter and airbrush finish powder that's pretty much it like super low coverage, uh, Essence brow products, Essence and Elf brow products, Maybelline Black Cherry Mascara, uh, LA Girl Gel Liner in the purple color, which I should know because I literally have the nub like sharpened down to this much. I love it so much. So that's in my waterline. And I'm wearing, I will show you the palette I'm wearing. So before it became Kendo Vegan Doing Good kindness beauty discovery don't eat animal byproducts uh cosmetics this was kvd this is the uh originally katherine von drachten whatever her her actual name is it, it doesn't matter um so i'm wearing this palette today which came out i think it was the, one of the last big per purchases last big launches or last launches they had with her still fronting the company so i'm wearing this palette today this is the lolita, uh, the lolita por vida um palette and uh let's see i've got lolita por vida and cariño mixed in my crease rosario pretty much all over my lids with luna going from the inner corner all the way to like the middle of my lid and then sonrisa is my inner corner highlight and it's this beautiful duo chrome i don't know if it's gonna pick up but it's like green pink a little purple it's kind of nice like almost like a really beautiful flip so this is a pinky purpley with neutrals thrown in color scheme i love a pink purple neutral moment a pinky purple moment i picked how many palettes six six with this one so this is what's on my eyes today and let's just go down the line here like it's really pretty now here is the i think the original with spawned the puerto vita palette so mine's a little beat up i it's all matte and this is actually a really nice palette it's it's pigmented and it works really well actually which I'm surprised promesa besitos hermosura con amor lolita corazón and eterno uh, I'm span I'm rusty on my Spanish but I hope pardon if I mispronounce anything or if my accent was or the enunciation part was wrong so please pardon uh, me so there's that so that goes in hand in hand with the Puerto Vida palette you know your little pinky purpley moment then I never really messed with this brand before and all of a sudden I was like oh what this <laughs>
dip dot. And this is the Zion palette. Look familiar? Because I can get the same look out of this from the other two palettes, except the, the Lolita is straight mattes. This one has one, two, three, four, four shimmers. And the rest of it's mad. I, I don't know if it's because I'm just getting older or what, but I'm appreciating a matte look so much more. I don't know what's happening to me. I'm scared. I'm scared. <laughs> Next up is the Nobble, 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 Nobble Cutie Palette. This one is Wild Berry. This is palette number five. Do the shades look familiar here? And as you can see, this one gets a lot of loving. So you can see a girl has a purpley pink magenta-y color story. Next up is, I don't know why I kept this in the box, but I did. Because I'm a Vlerdo. This is the Nomad Toscana? Is this here? Yeah. Toscana, which is Tuscany. And Italia. It looks far more brown in the palette but it's really pretty I know it's weird there's no purples but it's a bricky burgundyish red I think my lights in the night are just blowing this out but it's actually neutrally in purple like not purple but reddish leaning and you can tell I gravitate toward the same frick fracking story day and then my Natasha Denoni Lila palette this is my modified Lila this is not how the original palette comes this is my version of me modifying it um, it's beautiful look at that look at that mm. beautiful beautiful you are so beautiful me that's purples plenty of purples pinks and then just that hit right here like this little quad this little quint right here quad wow what is it with me and not being able to distinguish between the two cues of quad and quint but this little quad shade four shades here is a great little hit of neutrals in a purple pink palette Next, that'll be fine, is the Huda Purple Haze palette. As you can see, purpley pink, head of neutrals. Actually, that was seven palettes. I can't count, guys. Good, goodly, mugly. Shoot, my group. Uh, yeah, purple, pink palettes. That's about it. Because I'm like looking around. I'm like, do I have more? I probably do. Okay, so I was literally sitting here going, I think I have one more close by, and I do. This is the. Be Perfect Manifest palette. It is a 12 pan. Pinky purple neutral palette. I'm duping myself here. Now, not all of these are like straight up same color stories but they incorporate a lot of the same shades that I normally wear. Oh, such a pretty cover cover packaging but yeah that's all that I could literally think of I'm just sitting in my chair in my room going 
Hmm, let me just, and I just grabbed literally less than 10 palettes like that with the same color scheme just sitting in my collection over here in my old bookshelf, which is where I'm housing some of my makeup. It's got deep shelves. I still use my old bookshelf to put the remainder of my movies and then my new bookshelf to put 99% uh, of my movies that I have in there. So, ain't that a blip? Like, I have that many of the same palettes that without even thinking, I could legitimately just boom, 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 boom. I want you in my room. Okay, I need to stop or I'll just be singing that song all day, all night. Okay, guys, that's sad that I can legitimately just grab just a handful of palettes and hit the same color scheme. Like, I didn't even search hard. I just filmed one video and I legit just sat there and I was like, huh, I wonder if these all go together. And I literally just grabbed. Oh, I also have the She's in Parties palette um, from Melt and the Huda Naughty palette, which again also have the same color scheme. Oh my god, that's so terrible. Yeah, I have the She's in Parties stack and palette. So yeah, purple pinky color scheme. Oh my god. I do. I just keep duping myself. I keep duping the same colors that I have in my collection. I need to stop because I have all the colors of the rainbow. The rainbow has been curated for you, as Anyel Anyelka says, and uh, it has. And I keep recreating. Like I'm trying to recreate the wheel here, reinvent this wheel, and I keep. I have the same colors over and over and over. I mean, I'm looking here, I have the Norvina Volume 1, the big one, that's got it's full of purple. I'm not buying the Norvina Volume 5, okay? I want it, but I'm not. If it was the Abby Williamson version, where it's like saturated and the intensity's turned up, oh yeah, I'd get it. But uh, I've got one, two and three. Okay, so I have the Volumes 1 through 3. I'm a clown. I'm a homie, the clown, and I normally don't play that, but I got played and I played that and I could kick myself from that, but you know, that is another thing for another day on that. Why am I talking with a terrible accent right now? Lord help me. Anywho guys, I'm exhausted, so let's wrap up this babble. I need to stop duping myself, okay? I was supposed to go on a slow buy and then this whole International House of Pancakes happened you know end of 2019 early 2020 and uh, I went ham bacon potato pasta gray poupon and uh, expanded my collection like my collection is already large uh, for just me myself and I and the th thing is I used to share it with my mom uh, she, when I was, I finally cleaned out her room and when I was cleaning my mom's room, I found a whole eyeshadow palette that she panned every shade. I need to get like that. Okay. Love the makeup. Use the makeup. And it wasn't like she had just one eyeshadow palette. I have given her, I gave her like 12 and all of them used up and well used. But this was a woman who would get up every morning at like five, shower, brush her teeth, cook breakfast, have coffee, watch the news, and put on her face. So that was just my mom's routine. Uh, I don't have a routine like that. I, I, I don't wear makeup like, like this. Even, this is just like coverage. Uh, like this, I just go bare face, uh, moisturizer and sun, sunscreen, but bare faced and just a nice lip. And occasionally, put something through my brows that it that it that just be it but anywho I digress let us finish let's wrap this up thank you
you for watching. Again, if you like this, drop a line to see if I have any particular other colors, maybe a color scheme that you guys like to gravitate towards. Um, hit me up. We can get together. Turn it to 11. Boy, you know you wanna. Uh, hit me up. Don't ask me why I'm singing that song from the atrocious Gem and the Holograms movie from 2015, but it it just hit me. I was talking to I was talking to my nephew about it the other night, and it was just so weird. So, anywho, thank you very much for watching. Now, if you could just do me a solid, if you could please take care of yourself, take care of one another, let somebody know that you're thinking of them, write them, text them, call them. If you've been vaccinated, mm, and if nobody's high risk, mm, then please go see somebody. Reach out and touch somebody's hand. Make this world a better place if you can. And if you could, please wash your ass and your hands and your clothes and your hair and your reusable masks. It would behoove you to do that too. Hygiene. You'd be surprised. How many folks were just unhygienic before this whole in this whole IHOP started? It's concerning. Buying all the soap. Like y'all weren't washing your ass before? Like the, f the f what was you doing? Boo-boo. Ooh. Ugh. Atrocious. But anywho. Also, it would behoove you to make smart choices like washing your hands, washing your face, washing your ass, washing your clothes, washing your reusable mask. You know, um, as a person of color, I don't wash my hair every day, but I do things to ensure my hair stays clean and hygienic. And when I do wash it, oh, baby, wash day. You pre-wash, there is a game day before you get to it. And then you do your hair. And then the magic commences. But also, Again, making the smart choice is not always the easy choice, but it is worth it in the long run. I promise. It just doesn't feel like it sometimes, right off the bat. Right off the bat, it doesn't. Sometimes it doesn't. Also, please, please. Social distance if you need to, okay? Please. Uh, people are going buck wild. They get no buck in Drop it on the floor, they ain't got manners. No common sense <laughs> than those men can handle. Cause they out there just getting buck wow. Foolishness. As much as I want to travel and go home to Maryland and see friends and family, I reconnected with my childhood best friend and also I still have my best friend, my life mate out there. And of course my, my best guy, my Uncle Bob. Um, you know, and also I wanna do international traveling again. I'm getting my vaccine this week. I'm getting that Vroni shot. Oh. She's my only love. Roni shot. Getting my Roni vaccine. In that right deltoid. So, do be careful, be safe, make smart choices, be well. Again, any comments you would like to leave, drop a line. Drop it like it's hot, you know, drop whatever you like. I don't know, I'm slappy, I'm slap happy right now. So I'm just slappy right now, just. I need to go wash this off, like, go get my cleansing balm, get this off my face and then brush my teeth, put rollers in my hair and go to bed. So on that note, I can't wait to see you guys in the next one uh, very soon. Peace easy, take care. Bye. Bye, bye, bye. Check out my IG. I mean, it's boring, but check it out.